However, the shot calling generally not going to be as strong for the teams coming out from developing regions. So if you can get an out rotation, you're like, all right, we got the top turret, and then Zigzult comes through, just all the wind comes right back out your sails. Definitely going to be an uphill battle, I think, for the international wildcard team of Besiktas, but there's always a the chance they can do it. Team Solo mid in front of a home crowd, hoping to pull back from a loss earlier in the day. Yeah, Besiktas also... There's no way they don't expect that to be a TP. Dumbledore down to half again, also flashless and not six. So he's going to be in a dangerous spot. Santorin coming around the backside. I don't think he's been seen yet. He's going to yeah, be a close fight. For something here as the dark passage is going to be taken by Wild Silver, but Sant Santorin coming around the side. Shields down. There's another boomerang. Dumbledore just so low <laughs> misses the ult, but it doesn't matter as the death sentence comes through. Last boy flashes out of the way. So close to dead as Nadius manages to escape as well. But So if your lanes are all winning and the turrets slowly die, you're just going to keep winning the game by oh, kind of staying as is. Dude. Tries to ignore all the TSM members around him, but he's most definitely going to be... What? They're ignoring him, trying to give the kill to Wild Turtle. They'll manage to. Looking for Nadius now as well. TSM, oh, epic oh, man. Inferno Bomb for the epic overkill. <laughs> Three ults for an AD carry. Goodbye, Lucian. Botling turret. Barrage of bombs should continue. And the mid lane pressure not punished at all by not, Rexide. Not at all. TSM continue a very good set of word control and energy actually about to be flanked out by Dyrus' Maokai here. This might be a little bit risky. Flashes in. There's going to be a couple of knockups as well. Energy does have the ulti onto himself. Still going to take Mega Inferno Bomb and a re-engage comes in Theocles in a one versus four. Maybe not where he wanted to be as Rek'Sai running away as fast as possible. Now in comes Vladimir. Thaldrin doing whatever he possibly can. Bjergsen forced away. Oh, Nardius oh, picks Nardius. up the first kill for Besiktas. Looks like mid laners Do always the first well? kills. Yeah, Thaldrin is dead though. Last Boy forced to flash away. Nadia's at full health though, wants to find someone to kill. Last Boy might be in a little bit of trouble. There's the dash forward, but Wild Turtle. It's very risky for Besiktas to yeah. head over to that area because, you know, Zig oh, Sejuani. Okay, oh, looks yeah. like they will head over though. Yeah, there's the flash into the Twisted Advance as well. And Theocles, yeah, that's five members of TSM, dude. You're not going to survive that. Well, Dumbledore is about to face five as well. Bounce bomb hits the wall. Nardius right in the front. Goes for the middle. Tries to make the big play. Flash the way. Still goes down to the critical strikes. Dumbledore to the backside. Knocked down as well. Sniped, if you will. And energy also going to get dropped there. Four for zero. TSM off the back of a Baron. Maybe knock down some of these inhibitor turrets. As Baron times out, Dragon will respawn. So a convenient timing there. TSM can stop the siege, rush that down, that 13,000 gold each make it very hard for him to lose any fights here. Bottling is going to get pushed down, but she does not in position to stop them. It's going to be the turret kill and the fight begins. Yeah, and Hibbeter turret falling down there as well. Centauron looking for the ult, but doesn't even really need to use it as Theocles takes almost all of his health. Thaldren way in the backside of the fight is just going to fall down. Mega Inferno Bomb, do See you later as the inhibitor is going to be taken down next. Nadius with some decent footwork there, going to avoid some of the damage, but oh. man, Getting Arctic assaulted, energy gets death sentenced, and Lost Boy, this Thresh, super aggression, but he's landing these skill shots. And it's going to be enough skill shots to have TSM push into the base. Still a few slivers left on this Baron buff, and that means they can push right on in to Nexus turret number two, Nardius. Oh! Slinks away with the skin of his teeth, but this will be GG. A 26-minute game. Bjergsen forced to still run out, but it's going to be the Nexus all the same. Team Zillamid pick up their first win of MSI 2015. Congratulations, and Bashik, that's nothing they could do in that game, and that was TSM out with something to prove in that match. Yeah, Besiktas, they do get some valuable experience against TSM in oh, a yeah. lane swap. Lane swap's one of the hardest things to get very good, high-level competitive experience in.